In a spirited chase for history, Chaco Mucho outpaced Signal to the finish, clinching the last two sets in closely contested fashions as the Flying Titans carved out a 25-20, 23-25, 26-24, 26-25, 26-24, 25-23 decision to reach their first-ever Premier Volleyball League finals in the All-Filipino Conference at the Phil Sports Arena in Pasig, Tuesday night. Chaco Mucho's celebration of their sudden death victory was momentarily delayed as Signal contested the last call on a Vanny Gambler wide attack, claiming a blocked touch. However, upon review, the challenge proved unsuccessful, confirming the Flying Titans' historic march to a PVL championship. Chaco Mucho, which has finished no higher than joint fourth twice in seven conference stints, faces sister team and six-time champion Creamline in Game 1 of the Best of Three Finals starting at 6 p.m. on Thursday at the SM Mall of Asia Arena. Throughout the intense two-hour, nine-minute match, Wong showcased her setting skills, involving various players in the team's offense. Middle Cherry Nunag, in particular, shown with Wong's feeds for successful quick attacks. CC Rondina and Kat Tolentino, the team's 1-2 scoring punch, also flourished on both flanks. The HD Spikers, despite keeping the match close, were unable to match the Flying Titans' poise and endgame savvy. Threatened at 21-22 in the fourth on a Riri Menezes block off ISA mold after a long exchange, Nuneg scored on an easy putaway following a signal overpass and after B. De Leon fouled up on the service line, Tolentino banged in a hit on an open spot to put the Flying Titans at match point, 24-22. Gambler knocked in a through-the-block hit in the ensuing play to press the HD Spikers bid but the former 8neo standout missed her down-the-line bid in the next signal offensive, enabling the Flying Titans to soar to their breakthrough finals appearance. Rondina finished with 21 points, highlighted by her signature power blasts from above her blockers, while Tolentino delivered 17 markers, including several clutch hits. Nunag also took the spotlight with 12 points, the same output put in by Maddie Maddie Yake, while Mold added 10 markers to underscore the Flying Titans' balanced defensive sock. Gambler wound up with 20 points after struggling for 5 points in Game 2 while CES Molina finished with 19 markers and Joe Gonzaga and Menezes combined for 15 points for the HD Spikers, who stole Game 1 after trailing by two sets but lost in three close sets in the next. Gel Kayuna produced 20 excellent sets for the HD Spikers, who had three third-place finishes in six PVL conferences. Signal and Cherry Tigo will slug it out for the bronze in their side of the best-of-three playoff.